A scattered dream that's like a far-off memory. A far-off memory that's like a scattered dream. I want to line the pieces up. Yours and mine. Greetings. Greetings. Here we are again. Yes. Took a while. Took a lot longer. I feel like I went through one in Chain of Memories in the time it took me to beat two. Yeah, that's weird. Took me a long time. That's weird. Uh, whoa. Controversial. Here we go. Here we go, baby. Yeah. I'm like dreading this. Oh no. Yeah. Oh no. Kingdom Hearts 2. Wait, for, okay, first I want to talk about the gameplay. Sure. And the environments and how much of a step up from one that is. Mm -hmm. uh, specifically the way everything is connected. In Kingdom Hearts 1, I feel like it is a bunch of just square rooms. Yeah. Put together with a coat of paint slapped on there that says, oh, you're in Agrabah, you're in so-and-so. Yeah, you're getting a little, <laughs> getting a little <laughs> nuts, but okay. I'll roll with it. <laughs> King Hearts 2, though, really felt like the world was connected. Uh, you know, right off the bat, Mulan World is one of the first mm -hmm. ones. And just the way, you know, you go up the mountain and it's all connected down into the village. Everything just felt so much more uh, lived in, I guess. Okay. Um, and combat, obviously. I mean, yeah. I mean, they added a bunch of stuff. Yeah, it's still push X to win. You know, I play yeah, yeah, normal. of course. But uh, I don't know. It, oh, it's so satisfying. Like when you're in midair and you push circle and you like brace yourself and then you attack more. Yeah, and in the the new forms. The forms are really cool. I like those. Um, yeah, and just the the way the way you can choose. Uh, Attack versus magic, you know, mm -hmm. I went like mm -hmm. all strength build. Of course. Didn't have to wait, didn't have to mess around with magic really at all. But oh boy. The story and the pacing of this game I found way inferior hmm. Interesting. to Kingdom Hearts One. Um just there were, it felt like there was so much filler <laughs> just going to these worlds where it, it didn't really amount to anything. I mean, I, I'm, I'm trying to think back why I even needed to go to Port Royale, Johnny Depp land, or why I even needed to go to like Mulan. Are you even. talking about like even the first run through all the worlds? Yeah, the first run through it, and even going back like, yeah, the, the, the heartless and the darkness is attacking the world, but I just feel like for the first time through all the worlds, you're kind of just like a visitor yeah. stopping by yeah. for no reason. <laughs> there was no reason to be in so many of these oh, places. Man. I wish I could remember exactly why. Yeah, you haven't, played, been a long in, you haven't played it in a long time. I haven't played it since it came out. So you much. go to, like the beginning is incredible. I love right, right. that intro. That I, slow pace. I, I hear that the intro is pretty controversial with... I just think no one had a, like a ton of people had no idea what was going on. Yeah. Because I don't think a ton of people played whatever, Chain of Memories on GBA. Yeah. yeah. And they're playing like, who's this Roxas guy? Yeah. And why am I doing chores? Yeah. And fighting Setzer in a tournament with like sponge weapons. Yeah. And that, that's, that, <laughs> and playing 1.5 beforehand, you know, I, I have such a different view of these games. Again, that, that, that's a discussion for a whole nother time is playing a game the day it comes out or revisiting it. 10 years mm -hmm. later, the framing is so much different. But, you know, having that context of Chain of Memories and 358 mm -hmm. made all the Roxas stuff, all the Axel, like anytime Axel came on the screen, I was into it. You know, I was <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, right, here right. we go. I got it memorized. Let's go. I was so into it. But, like, the organization is gone for so long. And well, you you encounter them in the worlds. But, oh, it's it's super rare though. They're gone for a majority of that game. Well, they don't like over abuse it. I would say yeah. like how boring would be if there's an organization member in every single world like clockwork. Yeah, and 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 the ending was great. You know when the organization's motivation started picking up and all that. Can we know, talk handsome. about that Riku Sora team up, man? We'll get to that. We'll get to that. Oh to the man, end. yeah. That alliance. Oh, man. That's it's, it's pretty much <laughs> Sasuke and Naruto. Yeah, 100%. Uh, Xemnas is pretty much Madara. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> A lot of Naruto references. But, ah, uh, just... Yeah, the, you're having a hard time about this. Yeah, because I want to like it. And, and I feel like 
a lot of, I can already read some of the comments, you know, you gotta have patience, you gotta have patience. Metal Gear Solid 4 <laughs> is one of my favorite games of all time. That, that game is one big cutscene. Yeah. And, you know, we had this conversation, this felt like the Metal Gear Solid 4 of Kingdom yeah, Hearts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> if this was the finale, I wouldn't have been surprised. It had a very final feeling to it all. And, and, it, and I think too, you know, this is such a nitpicky thing, but the pacing, the loading did not help at all. Mm -hmm. I mean, I mean, this is five minute cutscene, load, cutscene, load, enter a room, load, quick battle, load, load cut, so much loading. I wonder if the loading times are shorter on PS2. Yeah, I don't know. That is a great question because it was it was pretty ridiculous. <laughs> and I, oh god, it sounds so horrible, like nitpicking on loading. If it happens a lot, it's totally yeah. valid complaint, like Destiny. Yeah. Whew. But so so in the end, again, okay, the finale. You know, after after a bunch of filler, and it sounds like I hate this game. I like this game a lot. Mm -hmm. I, I obviously want to continue the story. You know, it has me hooked. Uh, the end. Yeah, even the end when you meet up with Kyrie after all this work, you finally meet up with her, and they're just like, "Hey, what's up?" I think it was Kyrie. A little, good to see you. I'm hug. trying to remember. I think it was a little more than just like, "Hey, uh, how's it going?" kind of thing. It it sh I should have felt far more emotion than I did. I wonder if it's because you played it back to back, and for like the rest of us who waited years. But, see, that's true. That's uh, this. That is that's a very good point. That could have been. The fan service in that yeah. game, man. Whew. It's funny you say that because that's even like TV shows. When you watch Boardwalk Empire, five years go by where you where you know it builds up all these things, and now I'm binge watching it with my girlfriend, and she gets to this end, and everything just kind of happens. Mm -hmm. She's like, oh, you know, doesn't yeah. get that emotion yeah, because yeah, it hasn't sure. been such a long period of time. But I don't know. But I'm, you enjoyed it. Had its problems <laughs> for you, but you had a good time. Had a good time, definitely. Liked the secret ending. Somehow I unlocked it. I'm playing on normal and I got it. I think they just, Which is give cool. it to you easier now. Yeah. But you're hyped for Birth by Sleep? I'm definitely hyped for Birth by Sleep, but I feel like this game could have used an editor. <laughs> well, it's Nomura, so could, yes. <laughs> and, and to say that I fully comprehend Heartless and Nobodies and Zemnesses and oh, Xanorts and Ansoms. Get ready. There's so much I don't understand, Get ready. but I want to know. Yeah. So, until next time, we'll do some more. But Earth by uh, sleep's next, baby. You know. After that, uh, I, hopefully you'll get some more answers. When I when I don't like a game, I feel like I'm wrong. Just, I don't you're know. you're allowed. I mean, you <laughs> like the game, you just like don't like it. as much as the other ones. Yeah. Just totally fine. Yeah. You're allowed to do that. Cool. Next time. <laughs> Welcome back. Because of your bravery, the castle is safe and protected again. Thank you so much for all you've done. Good, Good work, work, you guys! guys.